Guys, it's me. Just a bit of an update on the Battle of Britain 75th anniversary group build as hosted by Charles Scale Modeling and Ian UK Scale Modeler. Well, guys, good bit of news. I actually, rather than wait another month for two spare parts, ordered another Hurricane in. And um, what I'm going to do is actually use the landing lights off of this and put them onto the current build of the Hurricane I'm doing for the uh, group build. So that we can proceed apace with this build because I don't want to be hanging around for another month and get disheartened because my mojo is on full drive and I'm thoroughly enjoying the build on this kit. Um, she's only got to have her front windscreen reattached, uh, the radio mast attached and uh, re be refilled today. And then I'll probably let that set overnight and... Um, sometime in the week I will get her primed and pre-shaded and then I'll post another video for you guys out there okay um, I'm glad this is coming because I've had a bit of a hell of a morning with Hermes trying to reorganize a parcel which uh, my friend Paul Breton kindly sent me um, it's not your fault Paul so don't worry but I'm just getting frustrated with them in general I know you use them all the time but in regard to parcels mate they are a nightmare um i won't say any more about it i'm not going to harp on about it uh it's just been well how many hours i've been at it six hours trying to sort it out on their website all you do is get end up going around in bloody circles i've made phone calls to the nearest depot he could hardly speak a word of english and uh i just gave up in the end <laughs> Oh, well, at least I can laugh about it. Anyway, uh, these things are sent to trialists, but hey, you know, that's life. Um, as I say, all I will do in regard to the parcel pool is leave a note. Yes, again, and hope to God that he's going to leave them with the neighbours. All right. Um, so I'm switching off because I've been on this ruddy PC, as I say, for six hours this morning, trying to sort it out. But hey. Enough said. Um, so I'm going to carry on with this. Um, what I'll probably do with this kit is wait for the spare parts to come in uh, for the landing lights, use them on this, and probably depict this aircraft as Douglas Bader's aircraft uh, at later date. Um, in a way, I'm glad I got another one through because this is a super little kit. Yeah, there were a few fit issues initially, but once you get past the build part, the, the main part of the build stage, it fits together like a dream. So there you go. And I'm also going to sit and relax and watch uh, one of a set of DVDs on a series called Tanks. I don't know if anybody's heard of it. Uh, that it was originally televised on Sky History Channel some years ago. And it, it was actually the series that got me interested in armour. And I've now got the whole set, as you can see up here. So I would heartily recommend if anybody thinks they're getting them the DVDs, by all means do so. They are very informative and extremely interesting. Okay. Anyway, guys, and uh, I just want to say to Paul, thanks for all your help, but I really do appreciate it, as ever. Um, as I say, it's not your fault, mate. Um, unfortunately, Hermes have let us both down, so uh, I certainly won't be dealing with them again. Anyway. Until then, guys, all you guys enjoy your Sunday afternoon and uh, get busy on the workbench. Uh, you guys be good, and I'll speak to you soon on a further update or even an inbox review. Take care.